My uh, name is Charles Scruggs. I'm an emeritus professor from the University of Arizona, and I'm offering a course now on Ernest Hemingway. I, the one reason I'm interested in teaching this course is I want to begin by quoting uh, Michael Reynolds, who says that there are so many layers of varnish over Hemingway that people uh, have lost sight of his writing because of the myths about the man. What I want to do in this course is to focus on major text and the cultural and literary context in which they appear. In the 20s, the 30s, the 40s, 50s, up through even the 60s, Hemingway was recognized as one of the great writers uh, in American literature. And I think he's been, I think he's been somewhat overlooked uh, lately. And that's a big mistake because he's in a very important writer. And he has a lot to say to us too, even in this lockdown, because he's aware of one of his major themes is just the simple isolation of human beings, the, the solitary nature of our existence. And so I, what I want to do is to kind of revive an interest in Hemingway because he's one of the great writers in the 20th century. And if we look closely at the text that he wrote, I think we'll understand why so many other writers were influenced by him. I, I would say this, and uh, I'm not going to apologize for it. I think he's probably more influential on other writers than any other writer, American writer. Um, in the 20th century.